welcome back. You tuned into your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso here on SABC3. Now, we are celebrating the holidays and we're doing so with new friends. Sam Scarborough has brought some of her friends from uh, one of some of the schools here. We've got Georgia and Lucano, who are both budding entrepreneurs. They're going to be taking over the world of business and we're going to teach them how they can sell stuff. And uh, what we're making right now is, uh, what, what do we call them? Heart-shaped flapjacks. These are heart-shaped flapjacks. And do you know how people love heart-shaped flapjacks? Like, they'll buy them every day. So if you had to start a business like that, you'd be very, very, very good like that. So how do we make these? Well, we're going to mix our dry ingredients over there. Lucanio, if you can start that for us into the sieve, please. Mm -hmm. And Georgia, over here, we're going to mix our wet ingredients here. Do you want okay. me to do these? And then I have prepared a little mask in the shape of a heart yes. out of um, tinfoil. How do we do that? I will show you now. Okay, very um, interesting. If you don't want to go that route, you can also use a cookie cutter. Yes. Um, I've got a little bunny shape here, but you also get the bigger heart-shaped cookie cutters. Ah, but the nice okay. one about this that you've made yourself is you can make it into any shape you like. Yes, I made some Easter egg shapes as well. Lovely okay, stuff. can you whisk this for me, please, Georgia? So Georgia's getting busy with our wet ingredients while Lucania is sifting our flour. So You're doing it pretty easily there, Lucania. <laughs> Okay, so this is the shape. I've made it out of tin foil, and all you do is get a piece of. Um, can you hold that? For me, I will please? hold this for you and tin foil. Yeah. And we just fold it up into a long strip. Okay. Like this, and over again because you don't want it too high. Yes. Oh, so essentially you just want it to be almost as flat as your. Just your the same as a cookie cutter. Yes. Height. Cool. Okay, so You're then... done with the sifting there, my man. Yeah. Lovely stuff. So Georgie, Looking let's good. carry on here. What's going on in there? Let's see. That's the caster sugar. Oh, Mix it all sugar. together, lovey. So Lucania and Georgia were telling me that they're in grade four, and this is the year when the mathematics starts getting tricky. But you know, as businessmen, you've got to be good at maths, right? Mm -hmm. So Lucania, can I give you a math sum to do? Yeah. What is 100 times 100? 10,000. 10,000, man! That guy, you know, what I'm talking well about. Alright. Georgia, I'm gonna think when I'm for you right now. Just down, okay. Okay, so I've halved it in two, and I'm going to now just join it at the top by folding it over slightly. Okay. Alrighty. And then I'm. Oops, it hasn't joined properly. You can just fold it twice. Just fold it sure. twice, and then. There we go. Make your heart shake. You're doing a great job there, by the way, that. Georgia. How are you doing there, Georgia? Lovely. Okay, there we go. So it takes a little bit of time just to get the shape exactly right. Mm -hmm. And which side of it go. then do you use? Any side. Any side, so you can there put it like that or the other way. Yes, okay. Oh, there you go. A little okay, bit okay. first. Let's mix yeah. it in. Save some for the last. Save some for last, you. okay. Because you want to mix it in nice and, you know, kind of evenly, right? It does help sometimes if you have an electric whirl mixer. Okay. Yes. Okay. Right. Can I help you there, Georgia? Yeah. Uh, okay. So, Georgia, I, I've just thought of a, of a math sum for you. Are you ready for it? Can you do big division yet? No, not really. All right. Let's let's really. do an, another another uh, big multiplication one. Okay, right. You can think. I'll finish this off. <laughs> Twenty-five times four. I'll give you some time to think about it. 25 times 4. What's 25 plus 25? 50. Look, I knew it's going to have. Yeah! Yes. Yeah, 100. That's what I'm that talking about. Stage Business fight, leaders wasn't it? of the future. High five. High five. High five. Yes. Uh, yours was harder, man. Oh. How much are we going to sell our flapjacks for today? Five, five rands? Five rands. Okay, so if we make 10 flapjacks. And they're each five rand, how much money are we gonna have? Let's think about it. If you've got five. 50. There we there go. There we go. There we go. Lovely stuff. So just tell me about the consistency of flapjacks, because it, when it's pancakes and flapjacks and all these other jacks and the other stuff, uh, never really know what the consistency is supposed to be like. Uh, look, I think for pancakes, it also depends how fat you want your pancakes. If you want those skinny paper thin pancakes, uh -huh. then obviously you add more milk or more moisture. And if you want the slightly slightly thicker pancakes uh -huh. or flapjacks, then you add more of the dry ingredients. Ah. So I use a basic recipe, but I do add and 
subtract as I go along to make the consistency I right. See, I see. Alrighty. Okay, last bit of milk, please, Georgia. The last bit of milk is going in there. While that's happening, of course, I've got to remind you that in order to get this recipe and the method of making it, all you have to do is SMS the keyword flapjacks to 33728 and we'll send it bling, bling, to your mobile phone. All right. Okay, this is getting quite difficult to mix here. Okie dokie. That's okay, you, you, you'll have it. You'll have it in a second, I believe. It's all my training for the two oceans half as well. <laughs> Are you ready for this? Are you ready for it? Okay, yes I am, yes I am, always. I hope so, I hope so. So guys, it's the holidays. Look, Anya, what do you like to do during the holidays? What's, what's the best thing for you to do? Um... I like... I like just... Chilling. You like just chilling? Yeah. And do you chill like with friends or do you chill with family? I chill with my brother. You chill with how old is he? Um, 15. Is he 15? Yeah. Is he a cool brother? Yeah, right. Very nice. Georgia, what do you do during the holidays? I play with my dog. Ooh, what kind of dog do you have? Sheep dog. A sheep dog? Yeah. Can he do tricks or can she do tricks? Um, no. She can catch. This well, that's good, a pretty but, neat trick. Yeah. What does she catch? Frisbees or tennis balls? Tennis balls. Now, that's hectic. Like, you know, it took me a while to learn to catch a tennis ball at first. So well done to you. What's your doggy's name? Blossom. Blossom. That's a cool name. Do you have a dog, Daniel? No. My dog died. Oh, shame, man. Shame. But we have Bob. Bob is here and you can play with him afterwards. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. So how's our uh, flapjacks looking? So we've just helped it along a little bit to set in the, um, in the heart shape. Mm -hmm. And we're just waiting to see if it's cooked a little bit at the bottom. Alrighty. And then what we're going to do is loosen the edges slightly when we flip it over. Oh, yes. And you might actually um, take the, the mask apart, but you can just put it back together oh. again. Well, and it looks like that. Okay. Guys, yes, are you ready does. to taste some delicious flapjacks? Yes. Well, here we go. With the berries, would you like some syrup? Here we go. On them as well, golden syrup. Yes, OK. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pull these closer to you. All right. So each of you. Grab a flapjack, heart one, an Easter bunny one, an egg shape one. Here we go, and I'm gonna give you some golden syrup. And while I do that, we have a special live performance in our studio by the Dancing in the Streets cast. Check it out. Stay with Espresso and SABC3.